Hello and welcome, Paul here, and I'm playing Warsword Conquest. Now, quickly taking a look at my troops. My weekly cost is so well over a thousand now. But we seem to be doing okay. I'm waiting to find out what my weekly pay is. Because if you didn't know, I've got some enterprises set up and it's going to earn me a bit of cash. And hopefully enough to make me a profit to where I can continue to recruit and yeah. So I'm basically in a pretty good position at the moment. Uh, let's have a look. I'm trying to work out where everyone would be at the moment. Oh. Let's not stand in one place, shall we? So yeah, I found out that these make a lot of money. And what did we work out make the most? Six, almost 1700. But that would require 8,500. And unfortunately, I can't afford to do that right now. I've got seven grand. I mean, I could go and could go in and just fight at the castle, but would rather not at the moment. Could go for something slightly cheaper. Darius the Apprentice. Soul Render. Oh, so these are like special things, not, they don't all say what they do. I'm curious if any of this actually works for me, you know what I mean, or if this is just something for my, you know, if it works for my allies I should say. I'm curious why there are three options though, it all appears to be the same. See, it's an enchanted shield, but why? What makes it enchanted? Marius. Was he one of mine? He was. Okay. Oh, so, uh, someone asked why I'm not selling these. Uh, the answer is simple. I might have a few more lizard men and if so I want to give them this gear so I've been holding on to it for now. That's all it is really. But we do need to earn some money. We do need to earn some money. So what's the best way to get back into the fight? I've got my allies just roaming around. I could go and try raiding, but there's just nowhere to safely raid. Not without getting caught out and destroyed. And that's something I would really like to avoid. Let's have a look at the tournament person. The Great Horn, okay. I mean, I could fight in the tournament, but... I wonder if I could avoid all combat just by sniping. Ah, uh, whatever. Not interested. I don't want to do the entire fight. Just want to let a bit of time pass. Where did he say he was meeting? It's all well and good. Okay. Let's accompany him.
Marius is advanced in level. Okay, so actually having a bunch of trainers is starting to pay off already. That is good news. Anton? No, not you, sir. Marius, what good are you? Drop my points into trainer skill. And he's an all round okay person, so that is good news. I just need to take it easy, take it slow, just be careful. I did say there were enemies in this area, the question is where? I wish it just didn't slow down as much as it does when I speed up time. It is quite a pain. Damn it, there's no one new. So is this the guy that's said I could get magical stuff. I mean, I bought this Chaos Rune Sword off him. It increases a couple of my stats, but really. I mean, is it worth it? That's what I wonder when I look at all of this equipment. Okay. I say we hit Goslaw. Find out what's what. I mean, I could try and raid a village on the coast, but the problem is I'm just going to run into enemy. We'll let them all get. That was so close. That was so very close. But they're all going to gather at Stavgard. May not be a bad idea for me to go there. No one's there yet though. Vardik Krom, Realm of Chaos. Why doesn't this person... Hmm. A waste of time. I'm just curious why he didn't have the Chaos Lord title. Masterwork Chaos Lord Sword. You see the damage on there. But I have the Gold Lord Sword. So what, what I want is the Cha Masterwork Chaos Gold Lord Sword. Oh my. Although currently I don't need it. That is such a, a cheap amount. I'm going to go ahead and get it just to get my shield back. It will do for now. Just taking a look and seeing what's available here. Reinforced Chaos Lord Helm. I guess Chaos Lord Helms vary depending on what you look at. I, partic I quite like this design more. So I might go ahead and get that whenever I get the chance. Lordly Chaos Crusher Boots. Okay. I do need the horse as well. And again, I've been trying to save up, but since I'm struggling at the moment, let's go ahead and buy what we need. Now I need to make some money, so we need to definitely go and find my allies. Any more of my allies in here? Nope. 
very well. Let us move on. Back up to Mount Veneer. Maybe. Like, my allies just need to go and attack, go and fight. They need to stop wasting their time. And there's like nowhere for me to raid, nowhere safe to raid. The orcs. <laughs> I like that the orcs are getting busy. Taking land for our, from our enemies. I wonder if I can sail up this stream. Ooh. got the same speed can I catch him we can so they only have 19 troops but they have a handful of strong troops left over so I kind of want to go take them they're gonna come at us with horsemen let's let everyone go down there Form a shield wall, just stay close together, do what you gotta do to kill these guys. Soon. You know what? My cavalry can charge. There's no need for my cavalry to stay where they are. Okay. Now everyone else charge. Yet to strike a kill. Ever since I picked up a shield. There we go. I'm starting to worry. They're dodging my attacks. Nonsense. Smash, punch, punch, punch. Okay. Actually, I can probably take every single person here, which is good. I just need to make sure my morale stays up. Look at this. This is how we sort of rebuild. Now, my weekly cost is going to go up, but if I can make that money, and with that money, buy more enterprises and get them set up, I won't have to worry about my weekly cost. That's what we're going to do. That's our focus. So let's return to the ship. Now, a bunch of people leveled. What champion is perfect? We'll disembark here because it's going to get much more difficult. We want to go to Kislev. Place we haven't had a chance to go yet. We'll visit the tavern. Mercenary. Orcs. Hmm. Nothing for us to make use of here. Very well. Enter the tavern. 
We'll find out where the next tournament is. Maybe we're in a good position. Tlax Kasaiba. I'm not sure where that last one is. But you know what? While we're here, we've got 4,000. Meet the Guildmaster. See what kind of enterprise we could do. Grapes would net me a profit of uh, 1,000. Olives, 1,400. Silk and dye, 1,660. That's really good. Okay, so I, I need money. I mean, I definitely need to make money at this point. I wonder what the chances of me being able to... Forest Goblin Army. Your money or your life. Oh. Okay. They must be confident if they're willing to fight us. How many of them are ranged? You know what, let's just go into them. If they're most... yeah, they're all on foot. Holy crap. That one just got the human spear. That's what I'm gonna assume happened. That's it. Bring him down. I feel like my one-hander is slowing me up in these fights now. And again, maybe not. The goblins are already trying to run. We won't let them. Don't let them escape. <laughs> Chaos guy on the spider. Nice. Good job. This is new pet. It's like, can I keep it? What kind of helmet has he got? Kind of a badass helmet that is. We could take the orcs for now, just to throw them into the fight. You know, ragged goblin skull armor might be worth giving to one of my allies. Did I have a goblin? I forget. I got a whole bunch of people. Chosen. Very expensive to upgrade, but worth it in the end, I imagine. And we still have these forest goblins here. So we... Chaos Dwarf Horde. So we could just stay and fight. It seems that might not be a bad idea. We've got the Chaos Dwarves on their way. We take them out. We'll have the Goblins. We can fight them too. Then maybe I can go and lay siege to this place up here. No sign of the enemy in our territory. I don't know where they're attacking or where we're attacking. I'm having a hard time keeping up, but you know what? That's fine. Maybe I should focus my efforts on going around, find some more tournaments to enter into, and then buy enterprises out in the world that I can drop like 8k on and I'll get 1500 back a week. Because if that can cover my weekly cost, which is starting to rise because of the quality of my troops, you know, it's not cheap. Weekly waged, 100, you know, it's almost 300 just between these two. So... You know, that's going to be pretty damn good. Anyway, that's it for now. Thank you for watching. 
Join me again next time.